Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, had a couple of questions, uh, and specific to the Asus versus the iPad, and why'd you choose this one or that one or whatever. Um, first thing is, I do like how thin the iPad is. Um, this is about as close as I've seen, uh, and I'd have to look at the exact specs. I think it's just a tad bit thicker. Uh, but weight-wise, the Asus Transformer um, feels very nice in the hand, very light, um, more so than the Zoom. And um, obviously you have some of the customizations, like I've got all my, uh, all my bookmarks right here. And I'm going to zoom in actually so you can see a little better and get this thing squared up. Because what I want to do now is show, um, specifically going to the website, or a website, and what are we at? Looks like we're on CNET. Let's go in and pull up. And uh, for the record, any uh, capacitive stylus works. I'm not sure what brand this is even now, but uh, it's got kind of a soft rubbery tip and it works perfect. Worked with the iPad 1, iPad 2, worked with the Zoom, and obviously works with this, any capacitive screen. Um, what I'm going to do though is pull up and show you one thing that, one of the reasons I purchased this and uh, what we want to do is I want to look at, uh, actually let's go to, let's say we want to pull up the Motorola Zoom, since I've already done this with the um, transformer, but I'm going to look for the manual. So I want to see the manual, which is a PDF, and it's going to take me in, and it says right here, most time when you see PDF, so when I click on that link, it's going to take me to a page where I can get to the PDF and here's a download. So here's an attachment. Owner's manual PDF it says I found online today make for some nice reading, blah blah blah. So if you have an iPad, you can download this on download this to your computer. Um, obviously go into iTunes and sync it, or if you have your iPad set up, you can drag and drop. There are some other methods, so you're not totally locked to iTunes. Um, but my preference is to click on it, and if you watch the bottom, it says starting download. So Basically, I go into my file manager, and I go back here to uh, downloads, and I've already put on some other things, but there at the bottom, Zoom, manual, DL, it's a PDF. Uh, obviously, I already had Easy PDF Reader I bought for that. There's a My Library, which comes stock on Asus and Polaris Office. I'm kind of liking Polaris Office. Uh, it does some kind of cool stuff here, and I'll show you. Um, so this is obviously... The Zoom's guide, but you can go in here and tell it to go fit to width, and it very nicely formats everything uh, just across the top here. And of course, uh, you've got if you want to check out this little arrow here, it pops in and gives you all your pages across the side. Which is if you've run any Office product, you're gonna or Office software that's not anything special, but kind of cool. Now this obviously does have a lot of pictures, so it's going to take a little bit to load up some of the pages as it's a uh, pictorial type PDF, so when you get on screen it's going to be blank, and then it's going to load in the page. Um, so it loads up, you know, as fast as anything I've seen. Obviously the more full graphics you have, uh, the slower it's going to take. But uh, that's done. PDF on the tablet, ready to use, simply not possible on the iPad. Um, and I've got even uh, going to school for IT, so I've got these are six and seven hundred page PDFs. So they're rather large files, um, but it's kind of nice to be able to carry around books that literally are. This screen is probably eight to ten inches wide, and the three books I carry or had been carrying are at least that wide. Um, so being able to carry around the Microsoft books and all the information I need for uh, the, the wonderful upcoming certifications, it's all right here handy when I want to study. Um, and the text is very nice on the IPS screen, just with this set up and I think this is, uh, doesn't tell me what, I think this is a, like 74%, very easy to read and uh, very viewable. So anyways, that's pretty much all I want to show in this video. Um, one of the very main reasons I purchased this is I do deal with a lot of uh, PDFs and sometimes downloading from somebody's site was always a pain uh, not having that ability. So there you go. Reason, uh, I would say that's definitely a top five for me and one of the main reasons I got a honeycomb based tablet that had that ability. So there you go. If you got any questions or comments, please leave them and we'll catch you next time.